What's up, gang? Alright, so the new year is up and rolling, and I wanted to continue our chat on being healthy and even being happier. So today, I want you to remember those Blue Zone people. You know, the five locations and cultures around the world where people live incredibly long and healthy lives, and also rank among the happiest people on the planet. I mean, these people got a pretty good deal. Live longer and healthier than everyone else on the planet, and be some of the happiest people in the world. And studies have shown that it isn't due to their genetics, but instead to their behaviors and the environment that they live in. So what are these behaviors and environmental cues that give them all these great benefits? Well, here's a quick list of the nine keys to success that make them happy and healthy. And they're called our power nine. Number one, move naturally. 10,000 steps a day or 30 minutes of moderate activity a day is what we're talking about. Exercise is great, but it isn't necessary. You just need to get moving. Okay, two, have purpose. Know what you want out of life and be willing to go out there and get it. Number three, downshift. As hard as you work for everything in your life, you need to be able to stop and enjoy them. So learn to take a step back. Number four, the 80% rule. Eating till you're only 80% full allows your brain to catch up to how full you are and also has been shown to help you live longer. All right, number five, have a plant slant. I mean, I love a great steak as much as anybody else, and that's fine, so as long as we're also having lots of fruit, vegetables, and other healthy plant food. Number six, wine at five. All right, a little goes a long way for this. A little bit of alcohol has been shown to make you healthier and also really make life enjoyable. But you need to keep the intake moderate or you lose all the benefits. So what does that mean? One to two drinks a day, no more. Number seven is to belong. Whether you belong to a faith group or a community group that just has a passion life, it doesn't matter. But belonging to a group that loves life and makes you happy is important for your long-term health and happiness. Number eight, loved ones first. Family first and always. Work and community are important, but don't go to your grave wishing you had spent more of your time and attention on your family and loved ones. They're the most important part of life. And finally, number nine, the right tribe. We all end up being pretty much like the people we hang out with. So choose your friends wisely and give more time to people who have the same values and want to accomplish the same things as you do. And that's it, gang. Pretty common sense. So what about you? How do you reap these benefits and build them into your own American lifestyle? Well, that's the hard part, the science of change. See, change is really hard, and we've been talking about it and resolutions for the last two weeks. And it's a really complicated topic that I can't get through in a two-minute tip. So if you want to know more about living a happier and healthier life and just how you can actually change your life so it's not a 50-day diet but a 50-year lifestyle, come join us. And your wellness team is putting on a science of change wellness seminar. Now, how do you sign up? Well, check your inbox right after the safety meeting. We just sent you an invitation. And if you can't make it, I'll gladly send you the PowerPoint and the handouts, which have all the information in them for you to work through yourself. I wouldn't leave you hanging like that. But if you can make it, I promise it's going to be worth it. All right, gang, that's all for today. I see.